Welcome to using your Maxidos DS708 video tutorial. Today we will be looking at the data logging feature in your tool. Whenever the DS708 counters a persistent communication error or fault in the vehicle modules during diagnosis, you can record and send the bi-directional information to our facilities directly from your tool. This will help our expert engineers improve the end user's experience using the DS708 in future updates. Remember, this data is intended for Autel technicians and cannot be accessed by the end user. Now let's get started. Connect your DS708 to the internet. Always make sure that you have the latest version of the operating and vehicle software before using your device since the problem you've encountered may have been fixed in the most recent software update. Go to the update program. If no new software versions are available to download, then your software is up to date. If not, please update your DS708. If you do not know how to update your DS708, please view our updating video by clicking on the link below. Once your tool is fully updated and you encounter a communication problem or a fault in a vehicle module during diagnosis, hit the home screen icon in the upper left hand corner. Once you're on the main screen, select the vehicle make you were diagnosing. After entering the vehicle make, click on the disk icon in the upper right hand corner and select start data logging. A dialog box will display. Where it reads file name, enter the VIN number of the vehicle you are diagnosing. Please enter in the box named file details a brief description of the problem. Then select OK. The disk icon should then become highlighted and a pencil icon should appear over it. This will indicate that your tool is recording all of the communication information between it and the vehicle. Go to the screen where you encountered the error. Once you have reached it, click on the disk icon on the upper right hand corner and then select stop data logging. Click it again and select report. The data manager screen should open and your data log file should appear saved as a part of the list below. In the spaces provided, enter the VIN number, year, body type, fault at control unit, and a detailed description of the problem. Once all the information has been filled in, check the box next to the file name and hit upload. Remember, you must be connected to the internet for the data log process to work. Once you have clicked upload, our specialized technicians and software developers will quickly attend to the problem and solve the issue for the following update. The file can also be reviewed on the tool by going on the main screen, selecting Data Manager and clicking Data Logging. This will bring you back to the data logging screen where you will also have access to the, all the previous logs you may have entered. You can also send the data log file through your personal computer. Install the CD that came with your DS708 to your PC if you have not done so already. This will install the update, wireless printing, remote access and data logging software into your computer. Remove your DS708's memory card and insert it into the memory card reader that came with your kit. Insert the memory card reader into your computer. Open the data logging program you installed on your computer. A screen similar to the data logging screen on your DS708 should appear. There is a drop down menu to the right. Please select the drive corresponding to your SD card. Check the box of the file you wish to send and fill out the information as if you would do so on your tool. Select Upload and the file should be sent directly to our offices where the engineers will examine and quickly fix the issue at hand for the following update. On the next episode, we will be looking at activating the remote access. Autel, tomorrow's technology for today's technician.